Amy Papian, a senior lecturer in human development and family studies. And I currently teach the human sexuality class here on campus, which has about 370 students. I really enjoyed working with the university museums and particularly the staff there. They've been really great to accommodate um, my large class and just give the students a really unique experience. Um, initially, before I had ever had them come in to do a presentation in my class, I was a little bit skeptical at first. I was hesitant to, to give up more class time and certainly with 370 students we were not able to do the um, campus tours or anything. So um, in working with Nancy Gerard, she suggested that they come into my class and bring the presentation to us. And so I decided to have them come and ever since then have been inviting them back because it's just been a really uh, unique and creative way to bring something different into the curriculum. And I think the art um, that students, the art on campus that students pass every day, a lot of times they just pass it and don't even notice it. So I think this is a neat way to give them something to think more critically about and then blend it into the human sexuality class in a way that helps them see the way that messages about sexuality are all around us and also um, in the eye of the beholder. So after Nancy comes um, to do the presentation, I give students an extra credit option where they can then take the things that Nancy um, talked about and taught them and go out and find some pieces of work on campus that they get to write a short reflective paper on. And I find that it's really neat to see how they come back and write things about how they used to just pass by a certain piece every day and now they're able to see it in a different way.